to have condoms in my matrimonial home. I mean, you're a big girl. You should have condoms in your bag and stuff. Leo, is this about trust? Do you think I have some kind of disease or something? No, I'm, I'm not saying that, but... So what's the problem? Look, I, I know you don't have any disease, right? But, but what if you get pregnant? What am I going to tell my wife? Leo, baby, I know what we have going on is just a booty call. It holds no meaning to me too. But you won't subject me to sex starvation and then you go run into your wife. No, I won't let that happen. Besides, I'm even the one who is supposed to be asking for a condom because you have a wife. Listen, baby, it has already been done. So let's enjoy the most out of it. Hmm? Wait, wait, I, are you in your safe period? Of course I am. And you think I'll even keep it if I get pregnant? Can you just...
Doctor, I think there's a mistake. You have to do another test or something, please. I already have. And it's the same result. You are HIV positive. It's not the end of the world. Being HIV positive does not mean you're going to die. Once we've checked your viral load, we have medication that can keep you strong and healthy for decades. I have patients who have been living with HIV for over 12 years, even longer. So long as you're taking your medication, everything will be fine. Mr. Leo, look, this is what I'm going to do for you. We have a support group that comes by the hospital every once in a while to help patients should you require any additional counseling. But, you know, we still have some more tests tomorrow. Mr. Mr. Leo, wait! Welcome. Do you like my dress? <laughs> I had it made specially for today. And the shoes. Do you remember it? The same one you bought me the night before our wedding. <laughs> I still feel beautiful in them. <laughs> I have good news for you. Not just one, but two. I'll tell you the first one now and the other later. Okay? <laughs> Guess what? I have a job. Yes, <laughs> I do. And the salary is huge. I'm, I'm so happy. I'm so excited. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
should I tell her? No, don't tell her. She will leave you and when people ask why she left, she will tell them you are with the disease. Tell her. Just tell her. Don't tell her. Look at yourself. Do you look like someone who has HIV? For all you know, the doctor doesn't even know his job. Tell her and be a free man. Free indeed. You are yet to lose your wife over what you heard. What if you tell her and you go for another test and the results come out negative? What will you then tell your wife? I bet you can explain to her you've been cheating, right? Look at yourself. Take a good look at yourself. Do you look like someone who has HIV? You look very strong and healthy. HIV doesn't show in the face. For once, do something good. Take responsibility for your action. There's something I need to tell you. What is it? Look, I'm very sorry. Remember this morning I wasn't feeling well, so I decided to pass by the doctor and he ran a couple of tests when I got there. I'm HIV positive. Okay. I know you might hate me right now, but I'm so sorry. Okay. I, I'm sorry for not being faithful to you. And, and don't push me away. This is the time I need you most. Please. You're just gonna keep quiet, yeah? You're not gonna ask me how I contracted it, how I was infected, nothing? Um, I'm positive too. A few months ago, I started having rashes on my body and constant fever that was on and off. So I decided to go to the hospital to run some tests. And the, the doctor told me that I was positive. At first I couldn't I couldn't believe it. So I went to another hospital and the results were the same. Leo, I have never been with any other man in my life since I met you. Never. I respect you. I respect you. Where did I go wrong? How did I feel you as a wife? I don't understand. What did I do to deserve this? Look, I'm so sorry. I, I really wanted to tell you. I'm sorry. I didn't. When? When were you going to tell me? As soon as I walked in today, I. As soon as I walked in today from the hospital, I just. I just wanted to tell you, but I couldn't. I'm sorry. I'm pregnant. Our baby is three months old now. I have everything I've always wanted inside of me. It's so beautiful. Alright, here's the good news that your wife has already been briefed on. Because you were diagnosed early, your child is going to be healthy and safe. So long as you continue to take your medication and follow all the required procedure, everything should be okay.
what shall I do when doing has been done? What shall I say when what to say has been said? What shall I do when no? Love 